Hi, I'm Murray Tessendorf, and I'm the National Director of Arosha South Africa. I think we're becoming increasingly aware um, in our normal daily lives of mental health issues and the fact that we need to look after our mental health. I think in the past there was a lot of uh, emphasis on bodily health and there's so many things that cause mental health. It can be cr crises in, in our younger, younger days. It can be the incredibly stressful environment we find ourselves in. It can be a a hormonal issue in our brains that causes the, the wiring to just not work in the way it should. It's just not given that we will stay mentally healthy all the time and so it's one of the things that we need to be looking, looking out for. The depression just it dampens everything to kind of a unexplainable degree on um, things that bring a lot of joy. Sorry, she had pretty, pretty dry on um, relationships that are like giving and so filling are um, hard to pour into and um, capacity drops immensely. Not being as mentally healthy as one would like is something I've experienced. Part of it came out of work I did with the emergency services, work, working as a chaplain, and finding myself frequent, frequently going to incredibly traumatic circumstances. I, I've also been in, in work contexts that, that have re revealed the cracks of the de de depressive aspect that is in me, that's just part of who I am. And I've learned to manage it, but I've always got to be careful because if I don't look after myself, I may, I may not be as healthy as I'd like to be. I actually was diagnosed with generalized anxiety disorder uh, about a year and a half ago. For me, I tend to easily get overwhelmed by, um, by too much going on at once. I had different bouts of depression throughout my life. Um, two most significant periods. Uh, both took place in locations near the ocean, luckily. The ocean for me became a place of being able to get out of my head and I think trying to be still within one's own self can be a very challenging thing um, when you have so many uh, external input coming in on um, what personally where a place during that season of time I did find I was able to be still was in the water like sitting on the beach didn't quite cut it i had to be in the water and it would change the focus in, in my experience maintaining mental health requires a multifaceted approach um, obviously there's there's exercise and there's diet but the opportunity to go into nature and to be surrounded by something that's so much bigger than us and is so intricate and honestly so beautiful if, if we prepare to, to look at the, at the little things and, and the great things around us, it helps us put everything in perspective. It very often quietens our mind um, and, and, and helps us to consider life outside of the normal environment that we find ourselves in. Often nature walks are used as a, as a means of therapy. The joy of taking a group of people into, into the wild and to help them see things that they've never seen before that's the kind of things that give me great joy. You need to find opportunities in creation to express your creativity. You need to know what works for you, to get to know the nature around where you live, to begin to explore, to begin to, to, to recognize the familiar things often. Go on a daily walk, find a wild part of the world that, that you love to be in. Take up birding, buy a pair of binoculars, get a camera, get a sketchbook and, and start drawing things. Try different things that, that fulfill you, that you get home at the end of the day and, so, and, and, and you can say to yourself, I've relaxed and I've enjoyed creation and I've learned something and I've taken my mind off myself for just a little while. For me, if I get really overwhelmed with a lot of different things going on, then focusing on something small is really helpful and it helps me to fix my focus to remember 
I don't have to think about everything. I can just think about the next right thing. Uh, and the same is true with the opposite. If I'm really overwhelmed with something small and all these little details, then I can fix my focus by looking at the expanse of the ocean or beauty of a mountain, the majesty of that. Um, and just, it's humbling and it reminds me that, that my problems aren't so big and that the problems of the world aren't all in my hands either. I believe that we were made to be in creation. And modern society, we've done our best to separate ourselves from modern creation. And I, and I don't know if that's done us any good. And so we've lost that connection with, with, with the sounds of, of the environment, with, with the, the, the beautiful things that fly past us. What one of the fellow interns here at Arasha, uh, Michaela, what she mentioned, uh, something that stood out to her was just the repetition of the waves and that those waves are are created from uh, gravitational pulls by the moon and the sun, um, which God has put into motion, right? And so there's this, this sense then that the waves are going to keep being waves because there is something greater beyond them that is driving that wave action. Um, so the wave just needs to be a wave. And that wave is not necessarily going to be perfect all the time, but it's a wave and it's good enough and it's constant and it's repetitive and it's still in its imperfectness is giving glory and praise to God. And we are God's creatures and we keep um, following him and being human, it is good enough and we can find some rest and freedom in that. You know, the, the, the very first purpose God made, gave mankind was to care for his creation. And, and if we don't do what we were made to do, no, not everything's going to work well for us. And if we find ourselves thinking, but I don't have any purpose in life, you know, you just go back to the beginning of scripture and it says care for God's creation. And when we start actively doing that, it begins to put us in a slightly different mindset we're not just concerned about ourselves anymore, but we're actually caring for something else and to the glory of God.